We're broadcasting from New Fear Stadium in Snuffalo, home of the thrills, and the world-famous waterfall, Viagra Falls. I've never seen a waterfall that goes straight up before. It's weird. This game is going to be a wholesale slaughter. No discounts in the NFL. The team storm the field. The Hexon Oilers take on the Snuffalo Thrills. Welcome to NFL Game Day. Grim Blitzrow here. Let's listen in on the sidelines and hear what the team's captains have to say. Coach, don't you ever hear the banana to the finish? Hey, man, how scared will it sell out? I don't want to hear what I'll sell out. If you like your cocktail cold, your soup hot, and your steak still mooing, then you're going to love seeing mutants not cold, their brains turn into hot lava soup, and their bodies strewn about the field, lying still and barely moving. NFL game day is on the air. Oh, you just made me hungry, Grim. I'm going to go get some of them extra crispy mutant finger strips. Hey, get me a full slab of broken mutant ribs while you're there. for a four-yard game. <laughs> Second down and six. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, hot three. He picks up five on that play. Third and two. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, hot. Three. The quarterback has had enough and calls a murder ball, dirty trick to lay waste to the. His cleats are caked in blood and guts, and he's looking to score. Oh, a great catch, and he picks up a new set of downs. Oh, and the late hit arrives right on time. When it's your time to go, it's your time. <laughs> Third down, and well, and the offense jumps off sides to kill the ref. They say, we're mad as hell and not going to take it anymore. <laughs> Third down, and the offense needs a miracle. Hot one, hot two. And that's a pick. And now the quarterback is cursing the defense, his receiver, the coach, everyone but himself. And he's the one that... Oh, man, his neck vertebrae just got crunched. Sounded like a gorilla sitting on a bag of potato chips. As they say at the deli, who's next? Oh, uh, uh, can I get a Swiss on rye with the... Uh, no mustard. And it's first and ten. And that's the way you play a guy. Nice coverage. Second down and ten. Excuses for this, and that was a bone crusher right there, folks. <laughs> and it's first and ten. Void rage, because if you can't answer your question with violence, ask another. And he, he sends him to the ground with an exclamation point and a well placed cleat. 
And that'll be second down and four. Hot one, hot two, hot, 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 hot. And he was running like he had a load in his pants. Picks up maybe two. Uh, we always ran with a load in our pants, Grim. It's a pretty good defensive tool. Yeah, except the zombies. They are freaks. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, hot, hot. Friends was an all pro NFL hit. You know, sometimes the best thing to do is just punt and let your defense get the ball back. And he booted a high arcing rainbow. Nice catch, and he turns on the afterburners. Punt returners in this league have a life. Oh man, he's brilliant. Oh, what a great defensive play that was, Bricks. Kind of like your Aunt Bertha. This guy has some big balls. What a hit. Yeah, she does have a big pair, Grim. You're right. Oh, the defender almost picked off the ball on that one. Second down and ten. If that hit didn't cripple him, it certainly left skid marks. And that'll bring up third and one. Chip shot extra point, but you never know with kickers. <laughs> it goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuff burrito from Taco Hell. Mm. Let's see if they can keep the momentum going and keep these fans happy and uh, or bloodthirsty, whichever. First and ten. Damn, man, I was here on the now. The 
Oh, man. <laughs> Second down in a lot. And that is a big gain. You know the defense wants some payback after that. Third down and six. And he picks up maybe four on that play. Oh, and you can bury that guy because he is dead. Did you see what number he was? I gotta check it off my dead mutant bingo card. I only need one more! <laughs> and they'll line up for the punt here. It's anyone's game still at this point. I know, which makes it so hard to place a bat. And up comes the most underrated position in football, the mighty punter. He boomed that one. Let's see if they... He's got the ball now. Let's see what he does with it. Oh, devastating hit. You ever get hit that hard, Bricks? Yep. Third grade. Just a merry of holy hell. I thought it was brass knuckles, but it was just a regular knuckles. Oh, my God! The defense play Picks up two yards on the pass. And this guy's six feet tall. He could just have fallen over and gotten two yards. And that'll be second and eight to go. It's a first down from a great catch. Was it a catch, though? Let's consult at least 72 pages of rules to figure it out. And it's first and ten. <laughs> Puts one over on the quarterback with a sticky ball dirty. This guy's a brick shithouse. Second down in a very lot. And that's a catch for three yards. Third down and long. on several occasions. Not surprising. Multiple times on each occasion. Not surprising. And trust me, that hit was worse. And he put all of his foot into that one. And, oh, what a brutal hit. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two. At this point, with multiple interceptions, the QB should just throw in the towel. He ain't probably even intercepted, though. Oh, and that's when a field. Oh, holy Montezuma's revenge. That's a crap your pants and die tackle. Oh, that Montezuma was very vengeful, wasn't he, Bricks? Wonder what made him so mad. Yeah, it was probably all the diet. No, you're probably right. Yeah, they probably ran out of toilet paper when he was in some all-inclusive resort, and he just got so mad and cursed everyone who came to Mexico forever to crack their pants. Uh, sounds like he didn't really think it through, because, you know, he should have made it specifically for the owners of the inclusives, but not the guests. What the fuck are you talking about? Uh, I don't really know right now. What day is it? Second down and five. And he's running. Oh, and he just left an outline on the ground like he was trying to wipe out the dinosaurs. Must be opposite day because he's the one who just got wiped out. He had it for a second there. The drive was stalled, and here comes the field goal attempt. It's 
good. Here comes the kicker. Ma, I can't wait to hear this. What's the kicker, Grim? Uh, this guy in the field. Oh, I thought you were going to tell me a story like, here's the kicker. When I turned out the light, it wasn't a broad in my bed. It was a chip wearing a wig. First and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. And the ball is lateral to his teammate. We're talking street ball. It's a six-yard gain. And that'll be second down and four. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. Sure, now he catches it. I had this guy on my fantasy team last week. I lost so much money on him, not to mention my kneecaps. My loan shark is very anal about collecting my money on time, Graham. Hot one, hot two, hot, hot, hot. And the defense gets the quarterback for a sack. Hey, okay, no, man, kill. Kill on, man. Get him on, get on, get on, get on, get on. Second down, and we've got to pick up at least half of this. Ah, another interception. Geez, you give this guy a bigger page. Boom, and he's dead. Oh, bingo, bingo, bingo. I got bingo, Grim. Oh, look at this guy break. Boom, to the moon. Another loser bites the dust. In the NFL, winning is really about how much you want it, Bricks. Well, he clearly didn't want to live as much as the other guy. That's a good point, Grim. And it's first and ten. He's leaving a wake of destruction in his path. The defense is relentless out there, and they get the turnover. Boom, dead and down. He delivered the freaky fast hammer sandwich with extra mustard for the death blow. Speaking of ham sandwiches, I'm gonna go grab one. You want anything? No, still working on my salami here, Bricks. Thanks. That's what she said. Ah, ah, didn't work that time. She was close, though. Yep. try and stay in this game. Oh, nice coaching move there. Hall of Fame caliber. Well, I mean, it's a pretty standard coaching move at this point of the game. I won't listen to this blast from It looks like the defense here that are shrinking pills. Uh, oh, man, he just laid the wood on that guy. Yeah, just, oh, man, he just killed that guy when the play was over. Well, if the ref didn't see it, at least the mortician did. He's coming out in the field now. And the offense quickly calls their second timeout. That's how you do it. And the hurry-up offense wears out the defense since they can't rest their players. Now the old broke-back mountain play. Got hit by a mountain of Newton, got his back broken, and now he's in. And they are out of timeout. The clock just became their greatest enemy. Really? The clock? The clock, Grim? I can smash a clock. That's not a great enemy. We're not talking about waking up at the crack of noon. We're talking about the NFL, you moron. Nail him right on the numbers for a touchdown. <laughs> Don't make any mistakes here, or they'll kick the shit out of you in the locker room. It's good.
When you give up points, you need to get them back. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if they can make him pay. And it's first and ten. Second down in a lot. And they run it for a couple of yards. It's a close battle as the quarter ends. Halftime is brought to you by those caring folks at Monsatan Industries. They make the world a better place by making the government tell you it is. It's anyone's game as the third quarter begins. Both teams have taken their performance-enhancing drugs, and everyone is ready to rock and roll. The teams line up for the second-half kickoff. Looking for a good return after giving up points. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck or if that was just a one-time thing. on the play. And that'll be second down and four. And it's first and ten. Don't want to make any mistakes here. Just kick the ball through the upright, for God's sake. The kick is good! Sam, as expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. The home crowd isn't impressed with that showing, but their team has a chance to respond. Put that guy out of his misery and says, who's next? <laughs> Boom, dead and down. He just sent a message with that hit. Yeah, the message was you can't kill the messenger because he's going to kill you. But then he won't be able to read the message because the messenger killed him. Ah, uh, going in circles. The burn returner was maimed by the opposing team, so it's up to the next man to replace him. Yeah, what exactly is a burn returner, Grim? You know, players who catch kickoffs and punts and run them back through the teeth of the defense. They have the lowest survivability rate of any player in the league. The next man up just sat back down on the bench. He probably grabbed his pants. And it's first and ten. Now 
looks like the coach is ripping that play from the playbook. What a dud. Second down and ten. Great play by the defense. It's not too often a quarterback gets rejected. That's why that's the position I originally tried out for. I want to know what it's like for other people to accept you. Now that went from a joke to making me feel feelings. Stop it. This isn't a place to feel feelings. Oh, the unstoppable force meets the explodable object. Catch the ball, get the first down, and don't die. See, it's really a simple game when it comes down to it. And it's first and ten. And with another pick, the QB says, I don't know what was from it or something. Oh, he just got crushed. First down and seven. Now, there are some who would argue that we should just skip this step and make touchdowns worth seven. What, and kick the kicker's job in half? They'd just be called sinner. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuffed burrito from Taco Hell. When you get knocked down, you got to get right back up and fight. Uh, what about when you get knocked up? What do you do then? Run. And it's first and ten. If you don't think you can make the interception, batting it down is the next best thing. Great advice, Grim. That receiver's gonna go far in this league if he listens to you. I wasn't talking to... Yeah, never mind. Yes, Brick, he will. Caught for the first down. And it's first and ten. And he runs it for four yards. Oh, no, that was totally unnecessary. <laughs> I got to see that one again. It was also freaking awesome. I hope they have raincoats in the front row because that was splattering everywhere. Second down and six. Oh, and he breaks free and has nothing but open field in front of him. He's at the ten. And he scores! They're going for two points. The best kind of kick is when it's right after a score. Hey, speak for yourself. I'm usually the one who gets kicked after scoring. And it's first and ten. Oh, man, Brooks, you've got to love a 
a player who goes down fighting. If there were any functioning brain cells before that hit, they're gone now. He's going to have the IQ of a rutabaga after that hit. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one. Great run for a nine-yard gain. And that'll bring up second and one. Oh, nice hit. That's the way you do it. Let him have it and then take it away. And that'll bring up third and one. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot three. And the quarterback drills one in for the first down. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot three. And he just slipped away on a quick pass, picks up maybe two yards. And that'll be second and eight to go. Oh, and he looks like he just saw 400 scary movies after. Oh, mama. Just call him Cap and Crunch. Another one bites the dust. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, hot eight. The quarterback goes down. Zoom on his face. I want to see if he's crying. Second down and long. And that's perfect coverage. Nice deflection. Third down, and the punter is warming up. And he held on to that one for a first down. First and eight to go. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot. The defense calls a sticky ball dirty trick. The quarterback can't dump it. And now they're going to dump his ass. Second down and more than the QB would like. Oh, a great play by the defense. The receiver didn't stand a chance. Third down and, well, hot, good luck. Hot one, hot two, hot three. Oh, and did he just put on a display there? Touchdown! <laughs> they want more points, so they're going for two. it in for an easy two points. The momentum in this game may be shifting. Ron, those are just my balls. Hey, thanks for sharing, Ricks. <laughs> the home team is feeling confident as they get the kickoff into the air. Scoring makes anyone confident. It certainly does, Bricks. It certainly does. High five!
what you wanted, Briggs. Well, he clearly didn't want to live as much as the other guy. That's a good point, Grim. The teams have kept each other at bay for now, but there's still plenty of time to bribe refs and kill the other team's star players, so it's anyone's game, really, Bricks. And it's first and ten. And he's off to the races. Look at that little mutant run. Ah, I don't think you can say that, Grim. Oh, boy. And it's first and ten. broke that one open, Bricks. Yeah, and I nearly married Trim Big Assian. And I nearly did not crap my pants earlier. Nearly is overrated, Grim. Second down, the size of Bricks Wiener. Hey! Sorry, partner. Boom, and he's dead. Oh, bingo, bingo, bingo. I got bingo, Grim. <laughs> the offense has no running backs left, so this becomes a passing-only offense. They can run their QB into the defense that's feasting on runners. <laughs> Sounds like a good plan, moron. Hey, watch it! And that'll bring up third down and in inches. He can go all the way! He's at the 20. Here comes the defense. And he bursts into the end zone for the score! What a run! Check the rule book. Is that a penalty? Why would I have the rule book? Oh, for fuck's sake. Third down and ten. Offense says it's time to put the ref out of his misery. is important. And he was stuck to him like glue. <laughs> Second down and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot. And he just wrestles away from that tackle. Boom! And like the Titanic, his ship just went down. Hey, hey I almost got that mutant bingo. All I need is seven. Seven to fight it. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two. Hot. I hope you covered your ears. Perfect pass and the score. Well, a little chip shot here, extra point, but this guy could blow it. Straight through the uprights. The 
And this kind of kick is when it's right after a score. Hey, speak for yourself. I'm usually the one who gets kicked after scoring. And it's first and ten. Right Rage ignites that deep down violent rage and makes you unstoppable. Uh, like he just ran into the line at the DMV. And guess what, Grim? That line ain't moving. Yeah, that was kind of my point, Bricks. Second down and ten. And the quarterback throws a murder ball, which will slice its way through any defensive player trying to block it. First and ten. And that pass play is good for eight yards. Second down and two. And they call a ginormous dirty trick. He's so big. And there's another pick. Man, this quarterback must have learned a lot about sharing when he was in school. Yeah, that's why he's so popular with the other kids. The ones not on it. And he finds open spaces running toward the end zone. Turn on your jet, you son of a bitch. The 20. Bam! Say goodnight to that guy, Bricks. Ah, uh, goodnight to that guy, Bricks. You're an idiot. And then Cats will give them a first down. First and ten. And he's able to grab that one somehow and hold on for the first down. This guy has a nice set of hands, Grim. It's the third set of hands he's had so long today. Looks like it's a good fit. Quarterback threads the needle for a first down. The quarterback shifts gears and goes into his hurry up offense. And another interception. This quarterback. Oh, with a punishing hit. First and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. Hot. <laughs> they quickly call a timeout, hoping to save some time for their offense. Second down in a very lot. Hot one, hot two, hot, hot, hot. Call man about a six yard gain. Hey, do me a favor. If my parole officer calls, I was with you last night, Bricks. And with one timeout remaining, the defense has to get something going here. And that'll bring up third down and seven. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot. Gets in there and swats the ball away. He can't catch, but he sure can swat. And the punter takes a break from knitting on the sidelines to come in and punt. His knitting is superb, Grim. That cross stitching, unbelievable. The return man catches the ball and heads upfield. Oh, great tackle! When his brain is unscrambled, he'll be thinking about that hit. Yeah, most likely in a Home. Time to speed things up. The offense goes into a two minute drill. Oh, nice hit. And a 
It's first and ten. And that's the last time out. They can't stop the clock anymore. Can any of us really stop the clock, Grim? I mean, when it comes right down to it, are we not all united by the constant reminder of our own mortality? Of death's constant, relentless advance? If only it was as easy as telling them, time out. You've got to catch that. The offense changes the pace by going into a hurry-up. Does that mean that defense gets into a hurry-up, too? I kill him. First down! He was not going to drop that one. They need to make him a target more often. And the quarterback finds his man for the first down. Oh, holy Montezuma's revenge. That's a crap your pants and die tackle. Oh, that Montezuma was very vengeful, wasn't he, Bricks? Wonder what made him so mad. Yeah, it was probably all the diarrhea. Yeah, you're probably right. Yeah, they probably ran out of toilet paper when he was in some all-inclusive resort, and he just got so mad and cursed everyone who came to Mexico forever to crap their pants. Yeah, sounds like he didn't really think it through, because, you know, he should have made it specifically for the owners of the inclusives, but yeah, not the guests. What the fuck are you talking about? Uh, I don't really know right now. What day is it? You know, this should be easy, but with kickers, you never know. It's good. The Snuffle Thrill, throw their home fans, and walk away with a victory. It was a hell of a battle, and they had just enough to cross the finish line. Good thing they got juiced at halftime. I want to get juiced now after listening to you two the entire game. Listen up, guys. The MVP is about to speak. Grim Blitzro with Brickhead Mulligan and Bricks Jr. and all the folks at Evil SN want to thank you for watching this presentation of the Mutant Football League. Today's game was brought to you by Comcrack Entertainment. They're not happy until you're not happy.